SNP wants two referendums, Scottish people may also be asked to vote on adopting Euro. SNP's spokesperson for international affairs, Aileen Smith, said that if Scotland voted to withdraw from the UK and rejoin the European Union, the decision to switch to the Euro will be made by the Scottish public. In order to return to the bloc, Mr Smith said, yes, totally. The obligation is to participate in the economic and monetary union. The euro is only part of the euro. Stable. In my opinion, the introduction of the euro is a democratic issue. Like Sweden, the people of Scotland should be mentioned in the referendum. Of course, the situation is that our national debt is too high to join the euro. So even if the national debt of other people is too high high and unable to join all the euro system, we are also not eligible. He went on to describe how the promise to the euro would work in Ireland and elsewhere, noting that there are many benefits. Smith told the Republic, commit to the eurozone. It applies to Ireland. It is also effective in many other countries. I think we can take advantage of many substantial advantages, but this must be a referendum. But from a negotiating point of view, this is not a problem for us. His comments, however, as the SNP confirmed that independent Scotland will keep the pound, worrying that his party will be confused. An SNP spokesperson said, the independent Scotland will retain the pound sterling and use our own Scottish currency if possible. No EU country can decide when to apply for membership in the Eurozone. Yes, eight of the 28 EU member states currently do not use the Euro. For example, Poland, which joined the EU in 2004, has not yet joined the EU. Prime Minister Nicola Sturgeon has previously stated that Scotland will retain the pound immediately after independence. The opposition party criticised Smith's remarks, and the opposition party argued that the SNP was surprisingly non-contact. Murdo Fraser, the financial spokesperson for the Conservative Party of Scotland, said, this is shockingly non-contact. First, the SNP will separate us through another independence referendum, and then force us to give up our position. The world's prestigious currency, blowing up the pound, especially in the economic crisis, will have disastrous consequences for Scotland's employment. Scotland will vote on May 6th.